Well, Beaver is the everyman. It's like a, a medieval morality play. Beaver is presented with um, a situation. He either makes the right or the wrong choice. And unlike a lot of the shows today, there are consequences. And Beaver, although he doesn't want to face them, is always made by his parents to face those consequences. So he comes up to it. The, the good parts that I like about Leave it to Beaver, the beaver will never lie. When he's caught, he'll look them right in the eye and he just won't just blatantly lie to him and say, no, I didn't do that. He'll say, oh, did you say, did I have this up there? Well, you, that's what you said, right? Did I? Well, but he won't just come out and blatantly lie to the parents. Um, Eddie Haskell is the nemesis. He is like the, uh, the fly in the ointment. He's always steering and he's played wonderfully by an actor named Ken Osmond, who is probably, I think, the best actor on the show. And not that Hugh Beaumont, Barbara Billings, and Tony Dow aren't good, but the reason I find Ken Osmond to be such a wonderful actor is the juxtaposition of him as Ken Osmond and Eddie Haskell.